So today I went fabric shopping again, and I'm most excited about this first fabric that I have to show you. This I went specifically to Joann's for. It is currently 40% off, and I saw it and immediately thought of a costume that I've been wanting to recreate. It is the Lily Collins Snow White from Mirror Mirror. Because of that, I specifically went to Hobby Lobby and got this pink polyester silk, which was also 40% off. Hobby Lobby is currently 40% off on all of their fabrics because I heard from my friend who's a manager that they are trying to decrease their fabric stock. So if you like any of this, I would go now. I bought this blue, and possibly to make a corset, as well as this gray blue. Again, just four yards of each, just in case. This tool is for a project that I want to do for Rococo ball gown design. And then I bought a lot of different trims just because they had such a great selection. A bunch of colors in the same style, several different blues and metallic -y golds, because I never know what type of trim that I'm gonna want for any of the dresses that I've been making. This faux fur trim was just too fun to pass up. There was only about two yards left on the roll, so I figured why not, just in case I wanted to line a cape or something. So I hadn't been shopping for fabrics at Hobby Lobby before, so I did not realize that their clearance section would sell trims by the bolt. And so I also got several different bolts of trim for the same exact reason. I never know when I'm going to want to finish a gown and I just figured it was better to have a surplus so I didn't have to go out shopping every single time. Some of these were on the bolt and some of these were pre-cut, but all of them were much cheaper than if I had bought them, not on clearance for specific projects in mind. I specifically liked this rhinestone trim. I also bought some lace again, just for some of the Rococo details that I have in mind and also found a couple other trims on rolls that I really liked, especially this leaf trim that came in several different colors. This pearl trim was too pretty to pass up. Again, not really sure what I would do with it, but if I go the way that I know I'm going, I'm going to just keep sewing. Um, I especially liked this chain trim because if you buy chain by the yard, it gets really expensive. As well as this chain with the little pearl details in the middle. I might use this for the dress I'm sewing now. Finally, just some buttons and closures. Unfortunately, the Hobby Lobby buttons and trims and notions are not on sale right now, but if you do end up going to buy fabric, let me know what you buy.